Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to check out Subnautica Below Zero. I played the first one, I didn't beat the first one, but I put a good 10-15 hours into it. Really enjoyed it. I don't know why I didn't finish it. I think something else came out and took my attention away from it, as usual. But anyway, so let's, let's try out the new Subnautica on PlayStation 5. Press Options. Let's see. Man, this looks beautiful. Start a new game. Yep. Cool. Different modes, as always. Creative mode. Let's try survival mode. Yeah. The way the game is probably meant to be played. And I recently got, just got a, a new... LG OLED TV, the CX, and I've been trying to mess around with that, get the settings right and everything, and holy crap, does this TV look beautiful. Can't wait for uh, Ratchet & Clank to come out, I'll probably be doing some videos on that, because that's my favorite Sony franchise, other than God of War, of course. But anyway, I'll be quiet so we can watch this. This is the farthest that I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. You sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me. And Sam. We need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Approaching 45 46 speed. Surface temperature is high. Drop on deployed. Good graphics. Holy smokes! That did not go as planned. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. So it's a little weird, the jump button is the triangle button. It's throwing me off a little bit. Might have to fix that. I'm blown away on how good the graphics look on this TV. Holy shnikes. You won't be able to see that on the YouTube upload, but I like how there's a little bit of pop in. <laughs> That's funny. Man, I'm still blown away by the graphics. Jeez. I'm easily pleased. Ooh. So think... Let's say Ark. Or like the... What, what was that other one? The Raft or whatever, where you're being hunted by sharks. But all underwater. The whole thing's underwater. Although I think they added a bunch of landmass in this one, so that's the big difference. I really like the first one. It's pretty cool. All right, how do I get in here? Found the drop pod. Ooh, trophy. All right, sister. I want to offer my sincerest condolences on the passing of your sister. 
I got to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546B, when we were thrown together as pacemates at Outpost mm. Zero. Food. She spoke often and fondly of you. I thought you should know. It didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Cool, it automatically takes negatives. pictures. Ah, oh, that's what that button does. Okay. I met was many things. Kind, clever, devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower. Impossible to miss. I hope you find the answers you seek. Lillian Bench. Hmm. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Okay. Resources. Basic materials. Okay. Tools. Here we go. How do you make the battery again? Copper and ribbon plant. Okay. Cool. Time to go resource gathering. Yeah. The survival game. Endless loop. Let's see. How do you resource get? Do you have like a special tool or can you just grab stuff? Been a while since I played the first one. I am like in awe at how good this looks on PlayStation 5. <laughs> And on this TV, of course. Where's my oxygen? There it is, okay. Ribbon plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy uh -oh. storage. I like how it highlights the base the whole time, so you don't get lost. I can easily get lost in these games. Ooh. Should Here. be able to use this. What the hell was that? <laughs> My buddy has a phobia of, of water, so he's like, "Uh-uh, I ain't playing that." Uh-uh. Oh, here we go. Dang it. I want to let me... Oh, you have to have the salvager. That's right. Oxygen. So if you click the right joystick, it takes a picture. Which is annoying, because I'm used to hitting that to you know, run fast in some games. Or change the camera. <laughs> so I keep hitting it. Oopsie. <laughs> Alright. Anything else? Ooh, there's some more rocks. <laughs> it's like silhouette. <laughs> Like, wait a minute, am I naked? No, I'm not, okay. <laughs> Alright, oxygen's pretty good. Let's go back up. Sometimes these things lead to something cool. Let's see. No? Okay. Like in the first game, there's a bunch of cool caves and stuff you can go in and find stuff. And then they had these exploding fish. Oh man, that's so hot. I died so many times with those stupid things. <laughs> if you watch the trailer for this on the, the uh, store page, it shows the exploding fish kill the guy. It's hilarious. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I have enough to make the battery. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily, this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Cool. Hmm. 
All right, can I make the, I need glass. Okay, that's the flashlight, the Bible knife, flare, and the scanner. Okay, cool, I think that's how you scan that thing that was all destroyed. Oh yeah, and then the, the locker, that's where you can put storage and stuff in. So it's like a, what do you call that? The storage bin, so to speak, an arc. My only complaint about this game and the first one is you can't make your own character, but since they're going for more for story, I guess it's alright. Now how do you scan? Why did you scan? Okay, cool. Where is the fishy? There we go. Fishy. Cool. Oxygen. Oh. I like how the oxygen lasts a lot longer than it did in the first game. I mean, I think it was like 15 seconds where you had to hurry up and go to the surface. So they fixed that. That's good. Any more resources? Uh oh. New blueprint synthesized. Ooh. Filtered water. Okay, cool. Makes me want to play uh, No Man's Sky. Oxygen. <laughs> Probably do that next. Alright. It's like penguins and stuff. He's floating. <laughs> there we go. That's a weird looking penguin. The older ones, yeah, they're different. There we go. That's kind of cool. Their beak is on their head instead of their face. <laughs> Discovered. Nice. <laughs> okay. Uh oh. Looks like a storm. we get back in the, the ship thing. There we go. New creature discovered. Huh. So I wonder what you do with those. Probably cook them or use them for resources. Needed a glass, that's right, for my. For, for my. What was it? Flashlight? Yeah. Oxygen. Eat something. Okay. Let's go back to the ship. Check that out. Alright. How do you bring up the menu here? Let's see. Oh wow, they give you a lot more storage too. Okay, consume. Mm -hmm. Can oh cool, you can just consume it. Nice. Uncooked, raw. <laughs> Okay. Ugh. Okay. Needle. Aha, uh -huh. that's how you cook it. Sweet. Oh. Oops. I killed it already. <laughs> uh air bladder oh cool so if you need to get to the surface real fast you make that and you're like boom back to the surface all right more copper yeah okay so you pretty much get the gist of the game new creature discovered
I like how you're gonna smash rocks without having to actually build a like a pickaxe or something. You just punch it, you're like, Ugh. <laughs> Oxygen. Man, it's getting pretty low. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Kind of reminds me of uh, Metroid a little bit. It's probably why I like the first one. It's really cool. Imagine a, a Super Metroid or a Metroid Prime game on the PlayStation 5 or the Series X with their super high settings and stuff. The game would look amazing. Oxygen. Like Nintendo needs to get that franchise up and running. Uh-oh. There we go. Almost ran out of air. <laughs> they need to get that franchise up and running for if they ever do get to 4K. That they're ready to go. And people actually buy it. That could be their Halo. Or Gears or something. Their mature game, you know? Ooh, there might be something down there. Now the video will be probably only be 20, 25 minutes long because the PS5, at least Oxygen. since the last time I tried, can only record... I think I record like 60 minute videos, but for some reason it won't let you transfer it to a device to, um, to like a USB in order to, you know, put on a computer, make a video out of it. You can upload it directly from the PlayStation, but then you can't like change the description and all that stuff as, as well. It's a pain. So I try to keep the videos under 30 minutes so that I can actually put them on my YouTube channel. <laughs> I keep hearing this giant beast. Am I full? No. Oxygen. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if there's stuff on the surface I can get. Ooh, what's this? Let's go check this out. That could be very dangerous. Alright. Get up there. Oh, come on. Let's see. Is there a way to get up there? Like, uh. Oh, there it is. A ladder. Mineral detector. Oh, sweet. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Uh oh. Grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Inventory full. Crap. Crap. Oh, that's right, it takes up different sizes of stuff. Alright, let's see, that should work. Alright. Huh. Alright, let's head back to base. Make some stuff. Never did find glass. Hmm. That's a cool looking plant. Huh. 
Oxygen. I'm gonna go back and beat the first one now. <laughs> Hopefully I can make some filtered water when I get back there, because water's getting low. Detector, cool. Okay. Flippers to swim faster. Oh, there we go. Glass. It's easier to get food in this one. My memory serves me well. Okay, let's see here. What do I need to make? Sweet. Enhanced swim speed. Standard survival tool, multifunctional. Flashlight. Let's craft that. And the flashlight. Then, darn, I can't make the fins anymore. I probably have enough to make. Yeah, cool. Alright, let's see. Standard O2 tank. Ooh, fiber mesh. Can I make that? Creep fine sample. Oh, I think I know where that is. Yeah. Oops. Creep vine. I think I know where that it's at. Start putting these away. Oops, not the water. Give me the water back. <laughs> Sounded like he took a leak, not drink it, drank a water. <laughs> All right, then the change things on here. Cool. Okay. Oh, sweet! It's got the uh, slight haptic feedback, like you're hitting a switch for the flashlight. That's cool. Your little dinky knife. Like, I cut you! I cut you so bad! <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oxygen. Really? It's been like two seconds. Alright, where's that one plane? I think, is it this stuff? Might be this stuff. No, yeah, here's the creep vine. How do you get a sample of it? Hmm. Seed cluster. Hmm. Oxygen. Get up there. Eh. Yeah. 
whatever. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. All right. Well, coming up at 26 minutes. Ooh, new fish. Cool. I wonder what that does. New creature discovered. Oh, sweet. You can let it go. That's cool. <laughs> So coming up on 30 minutes here. Oxygen. So to end the video, I'm gonna see how far I can go. Try to get killed. <laughs> if you've watched this far, thank you. I appreciate it. Hmm, oh, what's that down there? And you probably can't hear me hard half the video because uh, the volume is so loud. And I'm talking quietly. Oh, Oxygen. Different. Okay. I wanted to explore the surface a little bit. thing. Ooh, what's that? That's pretty cool looking. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I can't move. Oh. What the heck was that? Oxygen. <laughs> Danger. Right at the end of the video. Danger. Alright. Probably end the video here. Tune in next time if you guys like to, want me to keep playing this game. Uh, thanks for watching. And stay frosty. <laughs>